Man, it's hard to draw on this game. Even with the mouse. Which I have an especially hard time with, with, uh, because, you know, that stuff. I'll go back to Tingle's... Ripen Tingle's Balloon Trip of Love. I keep on catching myself saying Tingle's Rosie Rupee Land. No, that was the last game. Pointing and calling is strictly enforced around here. At the train station. It isn't really train stationing right now. It has some kind of royal family signature on it. Heh, this is a royal train station. Also, we got a faucet. Yeah, I think that's more than enough water. Why did we do the whole water thing? Well, I have no idea. There's a drain right here. How about we take the drain? Let's just take it out. So that ain't gonna work. Yes, how about lion? Okay. Yeah, it is royal stuff after all. It's the royal drain, everybody. The, uh, Bariki, at least you could analyze it. There's nothing illegal about that. Yes, very nice. Something tells me here OS it needs updating because I'm not getting very good analysis for this stuff. But at least we got some water. And rule of thumb and adventuring. Always get a bottle of water. You never know what it's good for. This is an emergency sign. Train personnel only, which means let's break in. Surely this doesn't count as breaking, right? Oh, looks like we're gonna need some oil for this one. Uh, where did I put that oil? Let's just lube it up a little bit. There we go. Is it rusty? Which is a bad idea. Don't try to open rusty things without your oil. So that ain't gonna work. Freaky, analyze. Maybe it's rustier than we thought. Oh, would you say about a hundred force? Okay, it's broken, therefore we need to brute force it open. Lion, you're up. You're the brute force. Wow, he only did that much? What is it? What'd you see, a mouse? You probably saw a spider or something. Wait, again? Always when I go somewhere. There's a person's hand underneath the door. Wait a second. Those aren't hands, those are gloves. That's what goes over hands. Kakashi, you're silly. Alright, we'll take the gloves. They belong to us now. Alright, we got rubber gloves! They clearly, they didn't look like they were made out of rubber, but, you know. Also, I forgot to scare away these bugs. You see, we have bugs right here. They could have scared Lion. It would have been bad. But we got some rupees out of the deal. I want you to go get Lion. Go get Lion right now. Where do you run off to? No, it's rubber gloves, Kakashi. You and your sensationalism. You're like the media. Alright, where did Lion go now? He ran off. We lost ourselves a What are you doing all the way out there? Man, he can really move. I want you to go get Lion. Lion's all the way over there where I can't click. He's on the top screen. Which means I have to make him on the bottom screen. Also, Jerkbird is back. He's resting his wings. I don't like him. I don't know why I don't like him. I just don't like him. Telekinesis! Telekinesis the lion! Lion, what the heck are you doing over there? It was just gloves. Do I have to get the farty juice? I'm gonna have to get the farty juice, aren't I? Ah, Bariki, analyze! Why is he scared? Yes, I know, I can see him from here. Oh no, he has a cowardice withdrawal. <laughs> Physical therapy! I like the sound of that. <laughs> and I know just the robot for the job. Hey, Bariki. Go, uh, physical therapy him. In the butt. Way in the butt. As far in the butt as you could go.
Physical therapy has been applied. And we got additional physical therapy just for the heck of it. Because Bariki's that kind of robot. She goes above and beyond the Call of Duty. And Call of Duty 2 and Modern Warfare. So, Lion, it was just gloves. He got his physical therapy, but he's still frightened. Do we need more physical therapy? Let's analyze! <laughs> Do we need more physical therapy? Please say yes. <laughs> oh, that, that's actually a pretty good idea. That's better than a kick to the butt. Lion, it was just gloves. It wasn't a human hand. There's no humans for miles. I don't even know what Tingle is. Alright, here. Take a look. This is the human hands you were talking about. I know I'm not an expert at this kind of thing, but I know hands when I see them, okay? Yeah, he just realized what he just said. Yeah, it was just gloves. Because you are a super strong ninny. Let's open those shutters the rest of the way. With the power of Lion. Now totally not as scared of the gloves. He just wants to have a look around. And then he'll see something else that scares him. And then we have to do this all over again. I did like that how Bariki just kicks things in the butt when they don't work. That's true robot technology going on right there. Alright, Lion, finish the job. I want to see what's inside here. Something tells me a train isn't inside. Absolutely not. No, I'm drawing the line right here. There can't be a train in this garage. Nope. No, sir. There's a train in this garage! How did I call it? I know what I said. Don't point it out. I'm always right. This is a dictatorship, not a democracy. It's an esteemed train, yes. It's it's royalty. It's got that going for it. Now we have to get it going again. Uh, anybody a mechanic? Bariki? Are, are you a mechanic? We're not having a look around. <laughs> Mechanized things, come on. There's a lantern here. Or a lamp. Hey, I got one of those. Yeah, we got a working lamp. Let's put the battery in. A signal lamp. I wonder what that's gonna be for. Let's take a look at more signs. Safety first. Yes, especially around the broken drains. Don't break the trains. Pay attention. Everybody, pay attention. This entire month, you better pay attention. Pay attention to everything. Also, I see a hat over here. Well, it's my hat now. Yoink! Conductor hat! I have a conductor hat and a conductor badge. We're ready for train things! Let's check out this locker, too, while we're at it. It's a dirty locker, which means there's dirty prizes inside. Ah, uh, there doesn't seem to be anything in there. Ah, we can't see anything. Uh, signal lamp. That'll light things up nicely. I don't think signal, signal lamps are meant to be used like this, but we're using it like this. So there doesn't seem to be anything in here. Well, why did they let us do all this kind of stuff then? They even give us the option to open the already open thing. Silly. Absolutely silly. This whole garage is silly. Let's go somewhere else. Actually, I don't think we could go anywhere else. We have a locked gate. I didn't find a key anywhere, did I? I don't think so. I mean, I could always go and find, you know, the Spoiler Hermit and give us a spoiler, but I think we're just going to keep on going. Look at the train wheel! And another train wheel! A third train wheel! The other one can't be seen, because this is 2D. Yep, this is train parts, alright! Look at all the train parts! You're learning all about trains today! Hmm, looks like there's, cause there's something missing off of this. It's like a coal hatch or something. Yes, a coal hatch on the front of the train. 
very daredevil trying to reload the train with coal. I'm gonna have to find a handle or something, but I kind of want to get in the train. Pretend I'm a train driver. Look at all this cool train stuff. I have no idea. And also, who's talking? It's one of those fancy smart trains. Must be a self-driving train. Bariki, are you imitating a train? <laughs> Actually, it was me. Choo-choo. I know that's not a woman robot voice, but do you really want that kind of stuff off of me? No, you don't come here for that. You came here for Tingle! I know what you're here for. You don't even care about the bird. So, Master Controller thing, eh? Is there a Master Controller in here? Yeah, sure, why the heck not? Oh, hey! There's a key! Now we can open things that are locked. Man, no Master Controller there. Master Controller, are you in here? Looks like there's, like, screwdriver things to do here. Yes, I, I said it. Screwdriver things. That's exactly what they are. Yeah, let's just disassemble this train. Because this train is dumb. It's talking to us. I think it's haunted by a ghost. Yeah, some sort of mechanism. I wonder what that is. This might be a clue to something that will be happening later on in this page. Take a note here. 7, 5, 1, and then 6. Like, at the very end. I can't see the rest of the number pattern now. So, write that down in your coffee books. That might be important. Yeah, that looks like something that would be Master Controly. It's a Master Controller! Seems to be missing something, though. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna work like this. We got some kind of peg. Analyze peg. <laughs> no, that's probably to, like, keep it all loose and not rusty. So we're going to need to find a tool or something, because Tingle's bare hands just can't move this thing. Obviously. Do you think you would have a puzzle in this game, in like a point-and-click game, where you could just solve it by like brute force? Like everything? Door is locked. Shoulder block the door. Door is now open. Ruined like a whole puzzle of finding that key now, didn't we? Anyway, speaking of keys, and, uh, shrines here. And these shrines of Rebello are in such a disrepair. Just let me have my fantasy. These are shrines of Rubello now. They breathe fire on occasion. And we cleaned it off. So, uh, are you good now? You know what, I think the shrine could be better than this. Let's polish it a little bit. There we go! That looks nice and... I knew it was gonna come alive! Wait, what? We just destroyed the shrine. And, and now it's Space Rubello! He went back to the Rubello constellation. So you better learn how to clean your statues, because then you can make rocket ships out of them. That's another secret. Oh, look at all these rupees! Give! Ah, uh, that's not a lot of rupees. Space Rebello, you suck. Back to what we were doing. We got a gate. We got a key. Ah! Uh, unlocked gate! I bet there's a tool back here that we need for the train. To make it work again. And all this junk! Ah, look at all this junk. Telephone is hooked up to nothing. Obviously, we'll never get calls on that phone. We can start our own little garage van back here. Huh, seems like a whole Kakashi could climb into. Now how about we enter it first? Yeah, Kakashi can't have all the fun. Look, there's bugs in here. Die, bugs, die! Including the golden one. It was worth like ten times as much. I approve of that. I just realized I forgot to close my window. 
So everybody could hear what's going on in here, and also I could hear what's everything that's going on outside. Oh well, they could enjoy Tingle too, I guess. Even though they can't see anything. It just looks like I'm talking to myself like a crazy person. Also, there's a blue bird here. He'll bring us happiness. We could learn more about the train girl. That's the yellow bird told us anyway. Or was that red bird? I'm not sure. Ah, bathe in water! Ah, but I wasted the water on the Rebello statue, though! Ah, she wants to bathe, and she's nice about it. So you know what? Before we do anything else, let's go get some more water for Bluebird. Bluebird is best bird. Oh, okay, Bluebird is good bird. Blackbird is best bird. Here we go, we got a little bit of water. Now we just have to find her something to bathe in. Because she ain't gonna bathe in my bottle. Heaven knows what else I'm gonna be putting in this bottle. I don't want blue bird feathers in it. Even if that's part of like a potion or something. Ah, what could we contain? Water. Ah, retro design. Hey pig, I found your cousin! It must be like porky flakes or something. What a lame motto. That is Porky Flakes. It has to be. They have like a monopoly on that stuff. No, well, nothing in there. Usually if there's drawers, one of them has a thing! Let's take thing! That looks like it'll fit the master controller. We're gonna take it with us. We're salvaging and putting this train back together. Aren't we smart? Here's the faraway tribune, the XX of OO. -O. So the the hugs of kisses. Far away sta far away far away station. That translation error there. Far away station opens. It's the opening ceremony. Why are they hiding it in a drawer like back in the junkyard? Oh well. You can now go to the city from this station. That's why the tracks are yellow. Did you notice the other tracks? They were not yellow. They don't go to the city. They go to a garage. And we can't read the rest of it. Oh. Let's just get a bathing pool for this bird. This teapot should do nicely. And no, don't boil the bird in the teapot. Just put the water in. Manually, like this. Oh, wait, that doesn't work? Oh, but the, the bird wants to bathe! Let's use the water on the bird! Huh. This should obviously be a thing. There's nothing in there. Yeah, I know there's nothing in there. I guess the bird is gonna go without bathing then, alright. Fine. You know what? This game is birdist. I hate it. At least we got the tool we were looking for. Which is great. Now we can fix ourselves a train! It's not really all that broken, though. I mean, there's some parts missing, like the master controller and uh, the lever for the hatch, but we never need to hatch things, do we? We do have this metal plate here. VL-1096! Hmm, that sounds like a serial code that we've seen before. But I forgot the, the first three numbers already. I didn't write it down on my coffee book. So, VL-1096, and we're gonna check that, that panel again, so you guys could get the full story on the number. Because the number is important, I think. Maybe. Maybe I'm just making you write down a number. 751-VL-1096, that's what it is. I make sure to note that in, like, a notepad or something, because that sounds really important. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't be driving this train after all? Because a lot of these things don't seem to be doing things. Hey, it didn't even make a toot! I mean, I appreciated the rupees, but we're not getting toot, and that's the only reason why that thing exists. But at least you have a tool for this thing. Alright, train repair, go! Train has been repaired! Activate! Don't even need any fuel or anything. It's in working order! We could go to... Oh, that's not good. 
automatic shut off. But we just turned it on. So would we have to enter some kind of energy core? Please insert Kakashi. Oh, hello, hi, how you doing? Is this how trains work? Hi! They actually train operators, there's four of us. Wait, who, you were expecting Tingle? They got a new train operator! He looks strange! Hi guys, um... You all look like very important parts. What are you doing just hanging out in the bottom of the engine? No, you can't do that. We need a running train right now. No, you can't go outside. Outside is not for you. You are train parts. Yes, listen to the, the important piece. The master computer or whatever he is. We need to start the train right now. The rebelling. Oh no, the machinery has learned! It's turning against its masters! You don't need sun, you're machines! Actually, you all look like very weird spark plugs. Get, get, hey, get back here! Ah, oh, that one got in my... I don't even want to mention where that one went. Hi, Chief. I see you're responsible. Yeah, now I can't run the train. So you can't run it by yourself. Some Chief you are. Now we have to find all the other pieces of this train. And assemble them in the right order. Luckily we got a list to do just that. Hey, it overtook my map! My beautiful drawing has been erased! We also have to put them in the right spot, but let's just cross that avenue when we come to it, how about? But you can't get them together? Some chief you are. So now we have more problems than just a broken train. Now we have a rebellious train, and all the pieces have ran off. Now oh, great. It's only in idle mode until we get them all. Next time on Ripe and Tingle's Balloon Trip of Love? This is a different kind of train repair. Good night, folks.